<laughs> My vertical posts are going to be about eight and a half feet above ground. And the general rule of thumb is to go one third of the post length deep into the ground, which would mean I need a 12 foot post about four foot in the ground. But that's not going to happen here because about 21 inches deep, I hit solid rock slab and I've chiseled eight inches into the slab so far. I'm going to go a little bit more. I need to cut a peg in the top of the post, two inches long and two and a half inches wide. Now I need to notch out the hole on the horizontal post. I'm gonna be using a 5 8 by 12 inch lag screw so I'm going to use a 11 16 spade bit to drill a hole through the horizontal post before I drill a half inch hole into the vertical post. I'm going to cut about 11 inches off the bottom because I couldn't get the hole deep enough in that rock and I'm still going to have about eight and a half feet above ground. Now I need to drill holes in the rock to drive in half inch rebar. I'm going to add a temporary horizontal brace to get proper spacing. I spaced the anchors out so there's 20 inches between the chains and these chains fit right inside of these anchors so you don't need a S hook. I got the swing set stood up and braced to the ground. Now I just need to drive the rebar into the rock slab and the holes that I drilled previously. <laughs> 